friends and welcome back to my channel. I've got another unboxing for you today. It is Owl Crate, but this one is the special edition Addie LaRue box, which I'm very excited about because I got an arc of the book from my job at Barnes & Noble and read it in September and absolutely loved it. So I'm really excited to open this and see what the Owl Crate ex exclusive edition looks like. So let's dive on into the unboxing. So first thing in the box that I saw was the pin. It says, a story is an idea, wild as a weed. And I love that it's got the rose gold. It kind of matches the, um, I put that right here. I just dropped stuff from my Switch, so that's fun. Uh, but it kind of matches the style of the um, death before DNF coffin and is that like the Ouija board thing uh, that came in the September box. So that's really cool because I really like the black, white, and rose gold together. So I'm glad that the pin is so pretty. A lot of paper on top of this. I'm going to try and do this without dumping it everywhere. Oh, and there it goes on the floor. Okay. We'll do a little black box. <laughs> Ooh, a wooden ring page holder. Cool. Okay, I have literally never owned one of these, but I've seen them online and I think they're super cool. Um, so it has some, like, I don't even know if this is going to show up well because the lighting is not great today, but we'll see. Um, so it's got some, like, vines and stars. And I'm assuming that this top part is the French for Once Upon a Time but it's it's really pretty so i have a drag i have a very tiny thumb so my it's we'll see how well it works when i actually try and use it but it is really pretty and i really like that so that's cool okay i now have little paper pieces of paper all over my floor but at least most of it is not in the box anymore so i can pull stuff out easier um so we have a candle and it's pretty good size too which is really nice um, it's by Alchemy and Ink, The Darkness, and the quote, he is the darkness she met that night, feral magic in a cut lover's form, looks like a C, not an L, since our forest, earth, wood, smoke, and night, and I literally cannot open it, there we go. Okay, it smells really good, and I like that it has the wood wick, because those always sound so cool when they burn. Love it. Cool. Okay. Got Addie's Perpetual Wooden Calendar. Cool. Okay, it's got plastic, so I'm gonna wait on that to open that up. Because my scissors are somewhere. And I don't know where. Um I've got ooh. The last word travel mug. So the last word is the bookstore that the love interest, whose name I literally just forgot, <laughs> I'm the worst, uh, he works there. So that's cool. Old, rare, new. Books bought and sold, Queens, New York, estimated 1956. And the quote on the back, books she has found are a way to live a thousand lives or to find strength in a very long one. So that's really cool. This would be nice. Ooh, it's even got like a tea infuser in the top. Sweet. Love that. Love it. Okay. Oh. Almost to the book, I saw it. Um, I think this is a, it's a journal and it's got gorgeous sprayed edges. Ooh, no, it's not a journal. It's a... Well, I guess it is sort of a journal, but it's like a three-year one. So that's pretty cool. So I'll start using this next year and just kind of jot down what happens each day, which will be cool because I can never keep up with actual journaling because I forget, but I feel like this will be better because then I can just kind of jot down quick little things. Um, but the quote, what a luxury to tell one story to be read, remembered. And I love it. It's so pretty. It's very dusty though. So it's weird. Or maybe it's just the paper stuff. I don't know. Okay. And 
to a book. It's so pretty. I don't like that it's in plastic. It makes it so hard to get it out. I still haven't even pulled the plastic off of my book from the October box. It's just sitting, waiting for me to take the pictures, and I'll take the plastic off at some point. Anyway, so, the invisible life of Addie LaRue. And on the back, never pray to the gods to answer after dark. I like that it's kind of the rose gold on the front. It's just so pretty. And then we got the end papers with the seven stars that are on Addie's face. And it's signed. It's just so pretty. Yay! The exciting thing about this is that it actually has the artwork because the art didn't have any of the artwork yet. So I can find one. It's got the artwork that it's talking about down here, and the art didn't have the pictures yet, so I had to just pretend I knew what it was talking about. That's cool. So pretty. Okay, got my scissors so that I could cut open the perpetual wooden calendar. So pretty. Okay. So, it's got just these super cool edges here, and I just love that the whole color is like this rose gold with black. It's just gorgeous. So this is going to go real nice on my bookshelf. And then this way I want you to know what day of the week it is and what date, because I don't know. There's a quote too. Oh my gosh, I love this. Life can feel very long sometimes, but in the end it goes so fast which I feel describes 2020 very well because it has felt like five years, but also it's almost November. It is the 29th? Yeah, the 29th of October today. So feels very long, but in the end, it goes so fast. So that was well worth the wait on the items and I am glad that I ordered it because the book is just gorgeous and I now have it and I'm so excited. I will just look at this pretty. Probably gonna reread it again. Don't need to. So I only met Brennan a month ago, but I'm gonna. So yeah, that was the Addie LaRue box from Owl Crate. Now I'm gonna go keep watching Brooklyn Nine-Nine. See you guys next time.